John Edwards here talking about why we filter. Um, most manufacturers, as a matter of fact, almost all manufacturers publish that 70 to 90 percent of all hydraulic fail system failures are due to contamination in the system. Um, and uh, when we talk about contamination, we're talking about particulates, which is solid matter. Uh, it can be a gas, whether you have air in your system and cause a, a system to aerate or cavitate. Um, and also it could be uh, a liquid. You could have too much water uh, in your system, which uh, uh, introduces uh, rust and oxidation to the, to the, uh, uh, to the fluids. Uh, so when you hear somebody talk about contamination, it's not just particulate filtration. Um, there's two ways that a system gets contaminated. One is from what we call ingression, which is uh, if you don't have a sufficient breather on your reservoir uh, and you're in an environment, every time that system breathes, you have contaminants making its way into the system. Uh, maintenance events, when somebody goes to change out a pump or a hose, uh, they're opening up the system to the outside components. When you have cylinder rods, in a, uh, especially in a dusty environment, that extend and retract, every time that, that those cylinder rods extend and retract, it's pulling back uh, microscopic contaminants back into the system uh, that's constantly being uh, ingressed into the, in, into the actual hydraulic system. Uh, the other way is internally generated. When you have metal to metal contact on all the, all the particles that are slamming together inside the hydraulic system, um, they're generating uh, contamination particles themselves. And what happens is when you start with a, a certain amount of, uh, of contaminants and you don't have a sufficient filter on them to remove those as they get generated, uh, then they increase and increase and snowball and snowball. Uh, and then you have component wear, you have silt buildup, you have uh, uh, sticking spools, and you have uh, pump failures um, and increased downtime.